Welcome, Johan and Mille Halbeck. Oh, fantastic to have a couple here, couple in this interview. I'm so happy that you wanted to do this. In spite of, you are just the, uh, the entrepreneurs, both of you, and you have these small retail shops, fantastic retail shops for home and kitchen gift shop. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for inviting us. <laughs> yeah, and you know, always when I come into your shop, we li I live in the small town here together with you, and I think your shop is the most fantastic one I have seen because every item in the shop you are able to b tell a story, and they are all special. Everything is special. You are very kind, Marcus. <laughs> yeah, but hey, guys, could you could you a little bit tell about why you are, your backstory about the shop and and yourself? So it would be interesting. I can start. <laughs> I worked for 20 years in the hotel business as a, a manager in, in, in the food and beverage side. Uh, and then uh, suddenly in the late 90s, uh, uh, we had a change in the ownership. So I had to think and uh, find something else to do. So instead of buying everything to the hotel, the hotels, I went to the other side, start selling for, for a wholesaler to, to the hotel, hotels in, in Finland. I worked there for three years and, and then... Uh, and then at that point I was uh, sort of uh, in between jobs, didn't know what to do. And, uh, and then one of our friends had a shop a little bit similar than ours now. And uh, then she suddenly had to, to, to close her shop and uh, uh, she actually um, encouraged us to, to open a shop. Okay. And so we did. And, uh, and the rest Here is, we are now. And the rest is history. The rest <laughs> is 2005. Yeah. And you know, because I love to come to your shop and, and, and speak uh, also uh, rumors and uh, uh, things like that. But, but then, one, one, then I realized one day that, hey, I want Mille and Johan to, make, to try this strategy thing. Have you ever thought that you would need a strategy in your business? Sadly no, not. No. We should have. To be we honest, we just worked everything. Yeah, and, and I think... To find, to try to find uh, new ideas and never took the time to sit down and think about the whole business. So it was such a good thing that you actually came. So we are really thankful for that. Yes, and you said uh, yes immediately, which was interesting. And you know, today, today I had a meeting with, with one, one client and, 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 and he said that, that every entrepreneur and small micro company should have the right to have a strategy. I totally agree. Absolutely. He said that it's a big mission for you to, to give them the right to have a strategy. Why would all only, you know, big, big companies and, uh, ha had the right to have a strategy? And so, so I think it's so nice that, that you took the challenge. Now let's yeah. talk about how was the thing. You were uh, one of the first to, to try out this strategy crash course. And, and you had the worksheet and you had these videos. Tell me a little bit, how, how did it go? Now, first we sat down and it, it took a while because we had to first to read anything in English and to find out how to work with the sheet, but... Yeah, maybe the, it was sort of a small language uh, problem that in the beginning, but then after a while we, uh, you know, got it and, and, and then uh, it went quite smoothly then. Yeah. And, and do you remember the parts that there was the purpose part first that why you are on the market and how was it to, uh, to answer that, those questions? <laughs> uh, <laughs> I think we, we, we immediately could write something there and then we were thinking that is this the right thing to, that we have put down on the paper? And, uh, we, and, were, uh, we were a bit, uh, you know, insecure in the beginning, but then, uh, you know, just took some, you know, we had to, to talk about it, you know. We took some beers and, and then it started. Yeah. <laughs> yes, right. yes. Yeah, yeah. And, and on the, on, on also on the, on the video course, I tried to say that it's everything is okay in the beginning. It's just to write something and then you iterate later and make it better. And then you came to the goals part and you started to write down the goals. What do you remember about that? 
Uh, no, now we, we have to, we have because... To, we I, have the great paper here. We are so old, so we can't remember anymore. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, yeah, we, we, we wrote six goals here. Yeah. And I remember, Miller, you told me that, 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 uh, that you, you asked yourself all the time that are uh, these good goals? Yes, exactly. yes, because it was a new thing, you know, so yeah, I felt insecure. But then, you know, after getting like the first ones, you know, uh, focus on the, the whole thing and getting the first ones done, then it was, yeah. you know, flow, uh, flowing. Yeah, so you had it in your head, but it was not kind of structure there, so. Right, and it's, right. uh, and it's diff more difficult in the beginning to put on paper. Yeah, it is, yeah. yeah. And then you group them under the focus areas, and you got the set of focus areas. Was it four ones you had? Yeah. Four focus areas, yes. Yes. Yeah. And how was that to group the goals under the focus areas? Was that difficult, or how was it? You mean on the last page, or? Yeah, on, on the one picture. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, yeah but mean, on the focus areas, yeah. the four ones. Um, no, for us, you know, with a small shop, uh, we can't have that many. Yeah. No, that's, that's exactly true. So, mm. so uh, do you want us to, to tell about it or? Well, like, well, no, I think it's more the principle that, that and how it was uh, to work with the, with the tool. It's not the substance at shot. But you can mention what kind of focus areas did you have? Maybe that's interesting. So better marketing. Better marketing. Okay, that was the number one. Products. Better products or right products. Yeah. Uh, loyalty customers and good loyal, customers. Loyal customers. Yes. Uh, and then cost-effective uh, purchases. Okay. Yeah. yeah that's, yeah, that, that's of course very important for you. Yeah. So those yeah, were the focus. Okay. Yeah. Yes. Those were the focus areas. Yeah. And then finally, you got it on one picture. Can you show how it, how the picture looked like? <laughs> the one, the, and you the, made the final result. Already. Yeah, that's it. There it is. Plated. Yeah, nice. In Swedish. <laughs> In Swedish, yeah. <laughs> so, so it's very easy to use as a working tool. Yeah. So, but, and I remember next day when you did this, I came to your shop because I was so curious. So I came to your shop and I asked, I asked Johan, he's called by the way, Haba, and, and uh, Haba, I asked Haba, hey, what was the number one point that you learned yesterday? And do you remember what you answered me? Yes, I answered, we had to start to do video, videos yeah. from our shop, <gasps> the video marketing. And I think uh, I was so pleased when you answered that because I thought it's quite a big thing. It's a big thing. Yeah, it it's a big thing, and I, and then I asked Mila the same, and remember what you said. I remember. <laughs> what did I say? That it, you said it, it. It was an eye opener. Eye opener. Yeah, that's what I said. It was a huge eye opener. The whole process, uh, you know, because because I didn't we didn't think about it before. Yeah. Uh, obviously, should have. Yeah. But now yeah. uh, it, 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 it really you know was like wow. Yeah, yeah, and I also remember that we have to be more active. That I remember that you said, yes. yeah, yes, yeah, okay. And and then uh, so now you have the strategy there. It's quite fresh. So now comes the questions: that how do you think you could use it? The the the, the page. Yeah, how could you use this now as a tool? We using it. we have it in our shop. Yeah. Because we have a small shop, so we have that, and, and we, you should use it every week. You should look at it and, and think okay. about these things. So you had, uh, how, how many goals did you say that you have there listed now under the focus areas? Four focus areas? Four focus areas. Yeah. And underneath we have ten together. Yeah, ten is quite much usually, and four is even quite much. So maybe you could think of still how many of those tens are active now? now maybe maybe four. Yeah, but that sounds good to in my ears, yeah. because that means that you are focusing on those now first, and the other ones in the backlog pie. They are waiting. <laughs> they are waiting because nobody can do ten things. They are waiting, they are waiting to be implemented. <laughs> sooner or later 
<laughs> yeah, and and, uh, and and of course there is all the time the, the operative work that runs the processes that you have uh, to serve the customers and so on. That's the main that, thing. That, that's, that's the main thing, and uh, that's the main thing. So there is a little bit time for for the development, but not much. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but still they are going together. They are going together. Yeah, yeah. So so well. Uh, so that was nice, uh, Haba, that you said that one, maybe even a weekly. But I've learned that you should, in a way, have a fixed time when you have a kind of meeting with yourself. Yes. Uh, yeah, that's you, you should put it in your calendar, but it's not yeah. so easy to do, but you should. You should, yeah. But, but I really recommend, maybe you don't have to do it every week, but it's good if you do it every week. In our small company, we, we have a weekly meeting. No, 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 yes, no. we should do that. Yeah. We start it now, yes. Marcus. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> yeah. So, so now my, my, my last question to you is that, uh, that all, the, all the people that are looking at this and have a small retail local business, uh, so what is your recommendation? Should, you, sh should they try your strategy or not? <laughs> Immediately go and book this and Absolutely. buy it. Absolutely, it was uh, well, like we said, an eye opener, and it's it, it, it has helped us so much. Yeah. So, uh, hey, thank you, folks. You are sitting in your in your living room, and you. Uh, and it's almost empty because we have a we had a small uh, renovation here, so. <laughs> yeah. That's why some of these are still waiting. Yeah, and, and, and have you had this kind of uh, uh, video conferences before, you know, recording uh, the meeting like this? <laughs> have you? No, this is the first time. So that's why we are a bit, maybe, mm. not so yeah. good. So we had to, I had to wait 55 years to get the first video conference. <laughs> <laughs> you can always learn something new. Yeah, that's true. Hey, thank you, friends. Thank Just you. love and thank you for, for bothering to do this. It's it's a little bit nervous, isn't it? And welcome to the shop. We have lots of new things. <laughs> and I, but still, I want to say that that you have to make these videos about your wonderful product because we we buy everything from you. And every time you show us something new that you have found, that, and then there comes the story. You're the, one of our best customers, Marcus. Uh, thank you, thank you. Can you talk slower? Can you talk slower so it lasts longer? <laughs> yes. <laughs> hey, thank you very much. Bye-bye.